Good morning, everybody. How are you today? Today, we are continuing on with Roots of Patcher, as you can tell. Um, I did quite a lot yesterday, other than the fact that I'm clearly just very awful at um, rhythm games. But that's fine. I I really hope there's no more uh, rhythm games um, in Roots of Patcher. But if there is, we'll just, we'll just knuckle under and just do it, shall we? But anyway, let's continue on. Oh, I forgot. Yep, just need to play it. So I hope everybody had a good day yesterday. And if isn't if this is halfway through your day, I hope you had a nice day so far. Oh goodness, sorry. But I think the I think the aim today is to get more copper, because I need to upgrade my scythe. What did I do the scythe? No, I must must have done the scythe. I can't remember. Also, I need to get that hoe, don't I? So I get judged by less people. Because I keep forgetting to do it. That's obsidian and wood. Let's have a look. Oh, a gift from Mana. Give me food. A Quinona cake. Nice. Rob and Mana are putting some targets together for hunting practice. Up the top where I thought it might be. Yeah, it's exactly where I put in it. Uh, oh yeah, I need to go talk to Ada because we're my animal got ill. I also completed an achievement. He's also finished my pendant and she's got my second. Oh, what did I need for that? Oh, I can do that now. I've got enough points. Bear and bones. Right. Bunners, we've got a busy day. Ooh, let's go pop some of this food away because I don't need it all in my bag. I really don't need all of this food in my bag. I still seem to have two... Uh... I won that festival yesterday. Did I not get a... Congratulations, you don't suck. No? Fine. Oh, I don't suck, but it's fine. Um, Hello, my loves. I'm so sorry you're still sick. I oh, know. Wait, did you have a cold before? I need to go talk to Ada to go sort that out. Hopefully I have the stuff. He's not going to get, like, sick, sick. Are you ready for breeding yet? No. Are you ready to make a baby? No. Keep riding you, aren't I? It's fine. Right, I need to water the crops. You can stay there. The one crop. Oh. Okay. Ooh. Oh, I've got two of those. Oh, I wonder if that's uh, one of my um, things I wear. Gives me extra. Are these done? Are these not done? Oh, they are done. Uh, oh. Well, that went up quick. Hey, Grandpa. Right, so let's six of them. Oh, they up here. I have. They keep regrowing corn. Let's plant some corn. I only have three of those, but let's plant some more. Um. Get some pumpkins going, shall we? Because they I thought they would uh keep growing back and they didn't for some reason. Well it's a squash. Oh yeah. Oh Casva Uh I haven't got any oh I do, it's fine. And then I also need to grow some more fennel. More of that. Right, to finish watering this. Need to go talk to Ada. This one's so ill, look at him. He's like dripping. Dripping with illness. Right. No, I don't want to ride you. You just you're in the way. I think this is him. Yeah, I know you need shearing, but I can't I'm waiting until everybody needs shearing. Right. Let's go here. 
Yep. Yep. Don't think that's in a treasure chest anywhere. I think that one might have been there. Nope. That one goes in there. I don't have space in any of my treasure chests. Ooh dear. Things are going horribly wrong. Right, I can go in there. Uh, oh, I need to turn that into mayonnaise. Hey, Bunners, you've been a good boy. Go, possibly. Right, let's go. Let's, let's get some quests done today, shall we? I've got quite a few I need to complete. So, I need to take out the fur and the bones. I need you not to run off. I need to go here. You keep running off. Oh, no. no. Yes. No. Oh, it's alright. I can sell the flowers. Right. Stay there. Is Ada in here or is she outside? Oh, I'm getting a cutscene. Oh. You really should go out and chat with the rest of the clan. Especially if you're ever going to meet that special someone. Mom, I'm just saying it wouldn't hurt if you were more social. Oh, hi. Tare's cooking smells great, doesn't it? Oh yeah, Tare's over there. She's just sort of hiding in the corner like, oh my god. She makes the best sweets I've ever had. That was my favourite part of travelling with my father. We'd make sure to share a meal with whoever we stayed with and tried their favourite dishes. Being here, I've tried all sorts of new things. I just wish I could eat some of the food from my clan. It's great that Tari takes time to cook for us, but I do miss food with flavour. Sorry, that sounded rude. I don't mean it like that. It's just traditional Jotun food. Jamotan food is made with lots of spice. It's an important part of our culture. My people would have pepper eating competitions at festivals. Kids even played it long, but maybe Parchins wouldn't even like our food. You should make some to share. Oh, even Tari like that. I think so. That's a great idea. And you absolutely should make some of your dishes you like and share them with the clan. Thank you, Tari. I, I'm sorry about insulting Parchin food. You have it all wrong. There's no Parchin food. Only Parchins. You, my dear. You are a parchin. Ah, well, I get the feeling the parchins are just sort of like the ones that take everybody in. They're like, sure, you can come live with us. And oh, something's just fallen off. All right. It's taken time to learn to navigate by the stars. No one wants to be lost at sea. I can't stop thinking about a melody Ibon played a few days ago. So lovely. Oh, Ada's not here. Oh, she's there. That's fine. She might be coming back in. Let's talk to Tari for a minute. Taste testing is an essential part of cooking. Is she coming back in? Yeah, there she is. My animal's dying. Looks like an animal living with us can fall ill too. I'll teach you a couple of tinctures that you can craft. They'll help the animals recover in no time. Oh, willow. Okay, cool. Most of the ingredients grow around here, but if you're missing any, we can check my medicine box. Right, that's Tare done. Sweet. No, that's not Tare, that's Ada. Uh, I need to go check that. Where is... Oh. I have so many things to do. Right, he's over there. Let's go sort him out quick too. Ride like the wind, muffin. He's over here. Whoop. I always think, always thinks I'm just being nice when I say our music is best in the clan. Change look. Any oh it was six. Damn it. We can talk about this later. Run. I thought it was five. I misread. It's fine. I have lots. It's a good thing I didn't sell it all. Go, 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 go. We need one. Excuses. Do not lay down on the job, mate. we got stuff to do. I just need to talk to Vark. Go get my sickle. Talk to these people so they actually like me. Oop. There we go. This is perfect. I'll go chat with Garrick and see what we can come up with. That one's done. The spirits always seem to want a little extra from Vark this time of year. God, they're so needy. Cooking with Tari and Nock does sound like fun. 
Time Era starts making friends in this clan. You know, you're awfully judgy. Just let your kid be what she wants to do. She wants to be... She's literally moved here for a season. You're already like, why aren't you married? Here's your new tool. I made it. It's going to last for years. I believe it. Right, where is Vok? Is he... Oopsie daisy. Is he... Oh, okay, he's over there today. Right, let's go. Just check. Oh, I also need to check out this thing that they're building up here. That's, uh, can I get a new developer, please? Oh, wow, look at this. Um, I'm not sure that's something I can really help with. <laughs> I'm going to... I'm going to look good training here. I mean, it's going to look great. I guess both are true. Bri's going to love having targets to hit. Sorry, I'm going to talk to the rest of them. I just want to pick those up quick. I need to go fix my animal. Having targets and weights is going to make practice even more intense. I think two targets will be enough. So they're actually... I like the fact that the village changes throughout the times. I think that's really cool. Right. He has a cold. We need to make... Oh, sh no, it is a he. I need to figure out which one's the cold medicine. Uh, it's in the crafting. Okay. Do, 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 do. Is that okay? No. Ooh, bird trap, box trap. Oh, here you go. Uh, flea repellent, tummy medicine, cold medicine. Any cold medicine herb and any oil. Oh, okay. Any cold medicine herb. That's digestion. Oh, it's burdock. Okay, I want two of them. And oil. And this one. Yep. There we go. So you may just sort of pop it on them. Where is he? Baby, come here. Ostrich is doing much better now. Oh, good. Oh, wow. I think his friendship might have gone down as well because he was so sick. Because I'm he'd got to the point where I could breed him, I think. But I think he had a couple of hearts as well. But at least he's healthy now. I'm sorry you were poorly. I'm sorry. Right. Now what do we need to do? He's doing that. That's fine. I need to go find what? Because he's still... Still up there. All right, let's go get him. Go. Let's ride. Hey, Grandpa, I love you. I never speak to you. I occasionally speak to him. I don't know if there's friendship uh, degradation in this game. Or if... Because that's the case. I barely, I never talk to the wolves. They're always just sort of there. All right, let's keep going. Hello. I pray and crawl like to get lost in their work. I'm the same way. Zelk's stories are even better than Tetith sometimes, but don't tell her I said that. Let's go. Assume he's... Oh, one of the boys is obviously helping. Nari has such interesting stories. Living with Zelk seems like an adventure. If Oka's wolves will lick you, it's because they love you, not because they want to eat you. That's when they bite you. And then lick their lips thoughtfully. Also, I can't imagine she'd have animals that would <laughs> eat the other people. It's a bit dangerous. He's still up here. For goodness sake. He walks quick for an old man. No, that's o that's okay. I'm not talking to you, I'm sorry. No, come back. <laughs> Stop running. You've got my stuff. It's the pendant of luminescence. Wear it often to unlock all its power. Okay, cool. Right, let's pick that on. Harvest gathering, sure. 
If I bind it, then I can actually see what it does. Because I noticed that if you fully bond it to yourself, you then get other skills. So like this one, I'm pretty sure originally when I put it on, it had a lot less. I think it was 15 or something like that. Oh, excuse me. Right, what do I need to do? Oh, I should have gone to go get my pyramid achievement. I could do that tomorrow. I mean, it doesn't really make a difference when you do it. And I'll be closer to that side. Um, yeah, that's good. <laughs> I don't think I can do anything in the mines just for now, because I think everything is tied behind... Oh no, I got the scythe thing, haven't I? I can go through Cloud Garden. That's right. Um, is it Cloud Garden? Horse Totem. Savannah. Cloud Gardens, yeah. Let's go to the Cloud Gardens then. Because I think that was the place where he'd grown all the weeds. And it said, like, you couldn't get through. So let's go, uh, sort that out, sorry. sorry. Hmm? Oh, there's more copper, that's just good. Because I will also click, 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 Not dance. No, not dancing. It's all right, it's because I've, uh... <laughs> it's because, uh, I had left it on the wrong thing, so. So, I wonder what comes after copper then, because copper tools were only... There was only two tools I could make with the copper. So, I wonder what comes after copper. I assume it's going to be through this area. Oh, that's obsidian. Sorry, I'm just taking a sip of tea. Get this green one. Here we go. Right, so I should be able to cut this now. Ooh, nice. Well, that's going to make life easier. Right, fine. It's a test. Are you going to talk about that now? Challenges take many forms. They do. Okay. Oh. The red, is the red Sardonis? Is that what the red one was? I can't remember. Agate? No, Agate was the yellow one, wasn't it? Well, find out. Sar Sar Sardius? Right, go through. Oh. I see torches. Oh, okay. I didn't see that. Right, fine. Um, no, I do need this one. I need to eat. Oh, I like the music here. Right, so there's a way either side. I assume it's the same premise... I was going to say, it looked like it had a little arrow, so I'm going to have to destroy stuff so the sand falls down. Okay, cool. Mm. Assume that's obsidian. Yeah. Okay. About this one. Okay, this one's an up one. I didn't actually mean to hit that one. There's actually one here, but it won't hit it. Fine. Oh, there's the sand. I hit that. Wait, 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 I've got a new I've got a new one. What is this? Silver. Oh! Oh! Where did I get that from? It must have come out of a rock I was smashing. Right. 
Yeah, it's taking quite a few more hits to break these. didn't actually mean to hit that one. I was actually going for the copper. That's fine. There's another sand pile there. Well, oh dear. At least I've got lots of copper. I need to make some more food. Ooh, that's not a lot of food. <laughs> I think I'm going to have to start making more food. So there's a way that way. Where's the other way? This one's got two. Oh, it's got one to the right. Which would imply this way. Maybe? Or maybe it's down here. Right, I'll go in and see if this one is... Because I need a teleport, really. There is no teleport. What's copper, though? Beryl. I see an owl point. It's going to tell me it's too late soon. I'm so far, I'm quite far away from the cloud garden though. I could probably run back. It does look like these ones might have like a little arrow, not an arrow, but like an area that shows you which is the way to go, which is good. Although I did get stuck. I don't know if that was true for all of them. No, they all look like they've got like a little... Because the other ones had the purple flower that you could find. So this I'm going to have to go from the top area, I'm assuming. Oh, unless there's a path there. I'll come back. That's fine. We'll go back another day. Yes, I know it's getting late. I'm going to have to leave my mount here. Hopefully there will be a teleport point on that side eventually anyway. So I will be able to just get across. Uh, let's teleport back to the land. I get they don't even call it like the town. It's just the land. It's the land that we live. He'll be fine. He comes home. Probably the reason why he doesn't love me. He's fine. These are mine. Can I pick them up? Still running late, and I'm going to fall asleep in the middle of the field. But <laughs> gotta keep poking stuff. Anna's isn't here again. Dirty stuff out. There we go. I'm gonna finish target practice. Oh, I didn't sell anything. No, I did. That's a lie. I didn't make very much, but I did sell it. Hello, Zayoth. Sorry if you heard that. Oh, yeah, I might have accidentally just smashed something. It's like, not actually broken. Right, I got a, grif a grift from Bra. And they built the dedicated area. Sweet. Eggles, yay. Good. Right, let's go in and check them. Dee 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 dee. You're all better. Yay. Everyone's better. I'm so happy. Let's run up here. Oh, are you all ready to be harvested? Lovely. Oh, don't hit him with a hammer. Yeah, I guess with the male um, goat, or the ovnix, or whatever they call it, um, you don't get the extra love heart for taking off, for like 
getting its resource because obviously with her i have to milk her with the boars you have to shave them you don't with the males they just drop a horn so it's possible he doesn't get the extra love oh thank god i can finally breed him oh we have to unmount him you ride ride All right the reason why i keep doing that oh he's got two base speed that's fine because then i can build his friendship up too Right, let's put the two goats in there. Or oh, Ibexes. Ibex and Muffin. That would be a good one if we could get three speed. Except Ibex and Muffin will have babies soon. That wasn't very... They will have babies soon. Hello, Grandpa. So, today's plan. I need to... You're going to stand right in the way, aren't you? Yes, you are. Uh, today's plan is I need to go... Collect my thing from the jungle. Uh, did I get any more letters? Um, I need to go put all this stuff in. I got 32 copper yesterday running around the mine, though. What is that? Prickly pear honey. How did I get that? Oh, did they make honey based on the fact that there's prickly pears there? Is that I didn't even realize it was a thing you could get. Oh, wait. Whoa, 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 that's a thing. Gives you forty-five stamina. Sorry. Get back to what we were actually doing, which was tidy. The honey makes different ones depending on what's growing near it. Ah, this is the first time I've actually seen anything change. Uh, keep those just for now. Yes, yeah, the first time I've actually seen a different type of honey. Normally it's just the honeycombs, which is what I expected to pick out of there. You go in there, you go in there, you go in there, you go in there. No. Do, do. I really need to take some more food with me. It's the first time I've ever had a uh, different type of honey. That's good though. Right, well, I have a milk. Try moving your hive near your pumpkins. I don't think I have any pumpkins planted at the moment. Yeah, I think I've uh, take out some of these and actually cook with them. I could do with some food. Uh, I need meat. Something with meat. Any vegetable, any meat. Any vegetable can be any vegetable. Probably have loads of vegetables. Does that count as a veg? No. Fruit. That's a seed. That's 40, 40 tomatoes. They're vegetables, that's fine. Yeah. Let's make, is it seven I can make? Oh, nice, what's that? Meat stew. Okay, and how good is that? 52, it's not fantastic, but it's better than nothing. Right. And it cleared up a space. 
for you. I might just need to make more chests. Right, they go down. Let's keep the honey on me for now. Yeah, I don't think I have any pumpkins at the moment. I can't remember if I put any down. Right. Doodly doodly do. Doodly doodly do. Is that weird man here today? Is he here today? No. I completed another thing. Oh yeah, this one. Oh, I wonder if it's because I celebrated the last festival or something? Oh, that one's pink. <laughs> Two very badly carved people. What is that? The impression brooch. Okay. What does that do? Swirls with power when that increases your charisma when talking or giving gifts. Oh, okay. Makes the people love you. Yippee. Right. So, go to this one. Fly this way. We won't pick up any of the stuff here. I need to get as far through as I can. Is I supposed to do anything else? No. He's finishing that, and I already know what that's going to look like. Uh, fine, I'm going to get the... No. I'm going to get this one, just because it's uh, one of the gems. Right. Oh, no! Every day this is going to come back. Well, I guess that's free food, I guess. Maybe not for me. This is fine. Right, I need to go... Did I go down this way? No. Like an entrance through there, though. What is this one? Seems we need a stronger tool for this. Oh. Oh, gold. Okay, <laughs> Look at the wall. That gold down there as well. Is that what this is? Are they diamond? Can't break it. So whatever that is and whatever that is, I can't break because my tool's not strong enough. Fine. Right, so this one... Hmm. Oh, I could have just done that. I went through there, didn't I? That's right. There must be another entrance down this way. Forageable. Actually, hmm. looked forageable. Right, there's the other entrance. That's fine. So I'm going to assume I'm going to need to find a. Oh, it's more gold. I'm going to have to find somewhere on this side that's a teleport, so I don't have to keep going through the. 
uh, the weeds every day. Although at least if I run out of food, like I don't know, in, I must admit I don't know in the winter if it the food disappears. Ooh, the ground's here. No, that seems to go down and connect with. Oh, this is going to go into the top of the um. This is going to go into the top of the one that the. It's dark. I know what I was going to say. Which I assume is there. Well, it's still starting to get some more gold, because the only way I'd got gold before was uh, Bark used to send me gifts when we became friends. But obviously now where so many people have been friendly to me, it obviously rotates who sends you gifts. Oh, silver. I needed silver for one of my... What was it? One of the accessories I could make. Oh, it was to upgrade something, wasn't it? I needed silver. Oh, this one's being picky. I would like you to break, please. There we go. And some gold. Right, let's eat this. I'm going to have to make some more food. Or figure out how to make better food. I'm going to have to be a monkey. So far, I've seen a monkey and a owl place. Is this the only... Yeah, okay, this is it. Oh, that one gave me a period. A lot of the rocks here seem to give you extras. Right. Let's have a go. Ooh. Okay, well, we've got this one. Oh, there's another thing here. There's a buzz around the caves. I can feel it. Yeah, honey. Okay, I'm going to assume that's honey. But it's different. It's got pot, which is not what my honey is. Well, actually, no, I just got that prickly pear one, didn't I? Okay, so that's obviously something of honey. Okay, cool. I guess that makes sense. Bears do like honey. Uh, anything else down here? And more? There's something. I don't think that goes anywhere. Okay, cool. Um, I could wander all the way back. More stamina? No. I must be due a teleport point then. I've done quite a lot now. So this one I need to go up because... Yeah, because I went across, didn't I? So this one I need to go up, and that's where the owl point was. Yeah. Oh, I walked under. <clears throat> right, so this one's an owl. Where's this going to go? Hmm. Yep, and then I assume we go up. Uh, well, there it is. Okay. Please be a teleport point. Starting to run out of energy again. I think I'm going to have to do a day where I just do lots of fishing. And make lots of the uh, fish recipe. There is a teleport point. Oh, touch a pair of rocks. Okay. I didn't know it was 
This room is a little puzzling. So it's a puzzle. Sweet. I do love puzzles. Okay, cool. Do I have to make it look the same? Not today, but... Go back to the land. I'll come back with more food. I need to start fishing and get some fish. I'm going to keep that then, because obviously I'm going to need that for a patch quest. So what was it? Cheese? So far I've got cheese and honey. I'm trying to think what the other one will be. Just a minute, I don't know. It might be something I don't have yet. Very much stone. Just sell it. Because I think you get one for it. And also it means that they can start uh, upgrading their houses. I don't think that's a thing that happens, but it might be. Also I need to make more food, so we need to go fishing. Because I think at the moment, oh excuse me, the best food I can make might be something to do with the fish. Um, well actually it's that one isn't it, but I don't have very many eggplants. Hmm. Actually that's the best one, but the problem is, is I like to be given that. Perhaps I should start, keep talking to the people. It could be that they're not giving me food because I haven't been talking to them very much. Yeah, that's pretty good. Can't, I have to find the seaweed though and the wild rice I can't grow yet. Mm, looks like it might be the fish one. Right, let's go to sleep. Next project is River Overlook. Is that... Is that like they're going to have like a little space that they can sit and look at the river? Maybe? Hmm, interesting. A river overlook. I mean, I like the fact that they had to do it to make it safe for the children and then they give them a stick. They're like, we must make sure... A race is happening today. We must make sure the children are safe. Rob. Oh, thank you for the meat. Uh... Oh, I need to go find Jock. He gave me meat. Well, it has to be red meat. Of course it does. Of course it does. Oh, thank God it's raining. The cheese is done. Love that. Love that. Love that. Um, I don't have any space for anything. I just need to make a new treasure chest. Right, let's just make another one. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, is anything grown properly? Oh, there, there we go. I think it's just stone. I don't think it's, it's stone and wood. Stone and wood? Yeah. Mr. Picklesworth. How much better are you than Mr. Picklesworth? I mean, your base quality is much higher, which means I'm getting a lot more off of you. Oh, you're ready to share. Mm. 
Right. Let's pop all this stuff in. Ugh. put this one let's put it there it's not right in the way but it's there uh, let's put that and that in there because I know I'm gonna need that for a quest oh and the chicken have a jam maker. Is that what this is? No, this grinds. One of these must be a jam maker. This one. No. Also, I might need to take this outside. So it's actually with everything else. Honey turns into mead. I need juice. Oh, juice. Uh. Okay, I can't make jam. I don't know why I thought you could make jam. Can I not use this in there? Nope, okay. Oh, that's awkward. Um, I must be able to turn them into something, surely. Can I put it in there? I, I do wonder what that's going to become. Right, I need to go talk to Jock. Where is he? In his house. Probably go down to the beach and see if I can get anything from there today. <clears throat> Which house is he in again? This one. Oh, of course, it's raining today, so they'll all be doing that thing where they go up and all speak to each other in the different places. Oh, look at all the puppies. This weather is a nice change of pace, don't you think? Garrick and I did it. We made a spinner to work the fibres into smaller ropes instead of just using our hands. It's actually pretty fun to use. Ooh. Well done, Jack. I can pet him. I have a feeling that might not be him. I love gloomy weather, it's so cosy. I have a feeling it might not have been him I could pet. Unless he's into that, which is fine, that's up to him. Oh god, yeah, it's a race today, isn't it? Where shall I put this? Starting to run out of space. Let's pop it there. Actually, no, let's not pop it there because I can't actually see it. Um, nice and messy, the way we like it. Any fur turns into your. Oh, so that's how you get the hay bales. Okay, well, I have. Did I have fur on me? I do. I chew guanaco fur. Do this. Hmm. Oh. Guanaco fur yarn. Okay. They sell for 303 each. Spun to perfection, cave lion cubs find it irresistible. <laughs> That's quite sweet. That sells for quite a lot. I have quite a lot of fur as well. I could probably spin all that. I'm just going to get rid of this crap. Okay. How much did this fur sell for itself? I, must admit, I don't know with the guanaco fur. 
have a look. I have some guanaco fur here. Uh, 126 for a normal one, and they were a black circle one, so I'm going to assume that they were slightly better. Oh, we keep some threads just in case we get clothes later. Oh, that's true. Although, to be fair, they plough through stuff so quickly, I don't think it's really an issue. Yeah, it looks like it might double it. That's pretty good. But we'll, we'll, we'll do it now. Um, so that one's 99. Actually, he looks different. And it's now 198. So, yeah, that's pretty good. And to be fair, my boars give much better yarn now. That's pretty good. I think that's probably one of the best ones I've had so far. Because I, I keep a lot of the food and stuff, but I haven't actually found that it was worth turning it into anything else. Oh, I need to do fishing as well. That's why I'm going down to the beach. Might be cheese. Yes, so... What did I do with the cheese? There was... Oh. So there's a recipe for cheese wrapped in an oregano leaf within my cooking area. So I assumed, well, if you're adding something to it, it must make it more expensive. But it really didn't. Actually made it worse. So I think um, I think a goat, the goat, the cheese that I make was selling for... What's the point? We'd sell for how much? Zero. Um, I think the cheese was selling for like 200. And then I turned it into... The one with the oregano, and it sold for like 56. So it wasn't even worth it. And it wasn't worth eating either. You need five plant fibre to make a hay bale. Right, so five plant fibre sells for nothing. And then it gets to 30, which is a profit. Da 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 Let's go sell profit. Actually, let's go down this way, because I can uh, then go to the beach and go get some fish. That, 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 that. Ooh, today's going to be a profitable day. Right. I made like a salad and it was worth like five. Yeah, I guess the point of the food, though, is for you to eat it, not for you to sell it. Which I guess makes perfect sense. <laughs> yeah, he used to harvest me and boil in the eggs for more money. <laughs> Yeah, that's the problem. It's the same as like I expected the I expected the pumpkins to regrow because in every other game I've played they do. And they haven't done. They just they're a one season thing, which makes sense because squash in real life don't carry on regrowing. So let's go do some foishing and corn yeah yeah i'm pretty sure once you take the top of a corn off it's dead right let's do some foishing Two. Oh, it's a squid, that's fine. Oh, I need some cephalopods for one of the recipes I've got. Do you know he counts as a cephalopod? He does. That's cool. 
because I have a recipe that specifically states that you need a cephalopod, so that's a three. Three. Is he swimming a bit quicker? What's another cephalopod? Yeah. Lovely. I must admit, I'm thoroughly enjoying this game. I think... I think playing it in short bursts has also helped me with my enjoyment because I have the issue of that I play games and then I sort of become addicted to them and only play them for several days and then I get burned out on them and I never come back to them. So I think having, because of streaming and only playing it for like short bursts, I think it's making me enjoy it more because I'm not like basically overdosing. <laughs> Effectively game overdosing. Yeah, burnout. Ooh, a wingy. Also, I must admit, I've always enjoyed playing games and having people watch. Um, because I quite like to talk about what's going on, and obviously people get freaked out if you're talking in your room when you're on your own. Um, so streaming really helps with that, because means that people can watch me who might not necessarily have seen me in the first place. But you they also get to watch the game and also listen to my babbling. Whoopsie day. Hoo -hoo, you're a f you're a picky one. Oop. Also, hopefully it will prevent some people from buying a game. Whoops. If they've watched me play it and it's really not good. The only game I would recommend people wait on at the moment that I've played is um, Spirity. Oh, for goodness sake, I'm so close. Is Spirity, and that's only because I know that they're still doing patches. But it is a really good game. But I played it on Game Pass, which helps. I mean, this game, I've already advised several people to pick it up. I mean, I know of at least three people who have bought this game because of my influence. You prefer this to Spirity? I do. I like Spirity. I liked the angle they were going for. Um, I just think it needed to cook a little bit longer. There were certain bits I felt weren't quite as fleshed out as they should have been. Also, I like that this is multiplayer. Well, Coral... Is it Coral Island? The one that I'm still waiting for because they're waiting for loads of patches. Uh, that's getting a multiplayer patch on PC, I think it is. May time. Um, but that's another one I'm still waiting for. I think that... I can't remember if they said they were having bi-monthly patches. Um, but it's one I'm really interested in, but on the same merit, I think I'm going to wait until it's properly done. Because they released it, but didn't tell everybody that the whole story wasn't actually out. So they introduced lots of new areas due to Kickstarter goals and stuff like that. And then they weren't really done, but didn't tell anyone when they released it into 1.0. So people have been trying to play the game and I can't because it's not fully completed. Uh, I need to keep those. Jellyfish. Mollusk. Fish. I actually didn't catch that many fish. In fact, I caught one fish. Everything has a cephalopod. Uh... Uh... Where is it? That one. Olive oil and... Oh, I can't do that anyway because I only dip in citron. Who says... Right. You can go on there because I know you self quite a lot. You can go on there. 
You can go on there. This one has to go in here because they will only go in here. Uh, and I'm going to... I don't know this fish. 45, it gives you 5 stamina. Where's the other fish thing? I might do that one. I've got oregano, but I'll do it in the morning. Yeah, I've got... Uh, the, what's the other one I'm waiting for? To Pixalia or something like that? Or... I think it's called Tupixalia or something like that. That looks really good. That's sort of like a Sims game, but rather than the Sims like it is now, it's like the Game Boy Advance Sims game, so where it was more like, this is your character and you live in the Sim world. You still have your, your needs you need to fulfil, but it's not a, let's create a family. It's more like the herbs. What are they called? The herbs? The herbs and stuff like that, which I really enjoyed. I liked the 3DS games. Um, so it's more like that and there's a massive town and there's loads of different jobs you can do and you can go back to college and go to university and do different things and it's all mini games and you can buy your own house or you start out in a flat and then you can move into a house and they're going to have farming because you can build you can go down to the like the farm area and have your own stuff it just it looks really good I think it's called Two Pixalia let me let me have a look Give me five seconds, I can find out. See. Yeah, to Pixalia. It looks really good. It's definitely one of those ones I've got on my wish list. But it's not available yet. But I'm hoping to get that. Like I said, for my birthday, I'm hoping to get a, uh, a new computer so I can actually stream and run games on the same thing without it being like, I'm dying, help me. Might be when you watch me play. Yeah, that's perfectly fine. I have an issue with people sitting here and talking to me in the day so I don't get any... <laughs> wow, I have a lot of money. I need to start making... Oh, I still haven't made my obsidian hoe. Probably should do that. Uh, Zeta. Oh, yes, more beanies. Beanies. Uh... I put both of those kubu mushkusukus in there. Oh, I had a nut there. Fermented chili. Can I now put this in here? No. Makes sense. Um, what was I going to say? I was going to say... Um, Watching me play games is now the perfect way <laughs> to not spend money on a game because then you don't have to do you don't have to do the uh, I'm really enjoying this game oh my god this is great and you go wow I'm going to enjoy this game and then you don't enjoy this game and then it's not my fault because then you've watched me play the game and you can decide fermented chili yum add to some cabbage and make kimchi I don't think that's an option sadly I will no longer be blamed for your bad purchases. Did I just hit him with a stick? And then, of course, we've got Fantasy Life coming out this year, which, of course, I'll probably be playing too. I'll probably pay that on, play that on stream, because obviously I can have two accounts. Um, so I can play that on stream and have my own account, which I'll play with my daughter and my sister. Because I really liked Fantasy Life. We can play together. We can play together.
To be fair, there's quite a lot of games that I can play now because I I, I get in. I think the problem is I get into my head too much, and I like to I like to have people watch me when I play. So which is the reason why I don't play a lot of games is because I wait for my husband to come home, and then of course by the time he comes home, we're also flipping exhausted. And nobody does anything. Um. So now I can sit here and play games. And there's people to talk to. Where has... I keep... Why do they look so weird? Is that... Oh, oh no, that's fine. That's the cell. There. And, you know, I'm going to have to sort these treasure chests out because it's really driving me crazy. Do you know the other thing I'd also like? is where I can click on, like, the cheese maker to select the thing to do. I wish the pot did that, too. I'm just reading Percy Jackson in the evenings now. Oh, nice. And you get to watch while you're working. Yeah. I'm excellent at most things, but Grob is the best I've ever seen with a spear. I'm lucky we to have so many different clans nearby, even if they don't get along. I'm glad Beckley likes you, but he won't stop talking about you. That the dog. I say, who's Beckley? That's Kessler. Beckley must be one of the dogs. This clan is full of creative people. It's too noisy if you make the half when it rains. The young people come over and play music. Hey, Grandma. Chechith knows quite a few stories about the stars. She really embellishes those. Quite like listening to audiobooks, but I'm too lazy after reading stuff all day to actually read. Yeah. I'm not good with audiobooks because I find that I drift off and then I don't pay attention. And the whole point is that I want to know what the story is, otherwise I just wouldn't have bothered. Mm, 25 stamina. And then nothing, I guess. Oh, I didn't realise it was cold medicine. Telling it all. Uh, oh. Where's Bok? Is he uh, probably gone off again, isn't No, I tried audiobooks, I just really struggle. If I'm going to lay down in bed and listen to something, it's going to be music, so I could just switch my braid off. Excuse me. So I don't have to worry. I'm literally taking all my stuff with me. Let's go. Took getting used to, but now I find it really easy to get absorbed. That's good. I actually play games to like have downtime. This is my downtime. I've done all my cleaning. So now I get to play games. And then the rest of my cleaning I get done at the weekend anyway. Because I take the weekend off. And Wednesdays is a day to look after somebody else's child. Because my little one goes to school. I think, I think if I do get more people that come in that obviously aren't just family members who are watching me, uh, I do think I may have to start streaming during the holidays too, because otherwise it's not going to work out and people will just stop watching. But it does mean I'm going to have to sort of like either shift during the holidays to stream at a different time. Uh, is oh, let me see. Excuse you. The totem chooses us for many reasons. I don't care. Uh, I don't have enough. Where is it? I think it's on the first row. 
We don't have enough beryl. Why did I not realise this? I don't actually have enough of anything. Can I make anything? Make that. Increases your charisma when chatting with others. Is that not just what that is? Oh no, it is different. Ten gift giving and one charm. Five charm. So that just makes it better when you give gifts. Oh, I don't know. I'd quite like to be quicker. I don't have enough to make anything except for this one. Do you know what? Let's just make it. Because then I've done. Right, that's great. Let's go. Oh, running into the, trying to read. I very much concentrate to one on the other. It depends on what I'm doing and who is around me when I'm at work. It's going to be hard to you as your family members who throw their children at you. Yes, I do. I guess the thing is, is just being more... I'm going to have to tell people that I have a job now and where <laughs> if it gets if it gets to the point where it becomes like a job I think I'm going to have to tell people that I'm doing a job and if they ask what it is just say content creation and if they ask any more than that either I don't know I guess if it it was never the intention to get big the intention was to play and be able to have people watch me and try a VTuber uh, if that is something that's going to happen, it's obviously I'm going to have to tattle. Uh, which is fine. Oh no, I still need to... Come on, concentrate. We need to We need to go down to her and make the thing. Come on. Social media manager. I can say social media influencer. I'm an influencer. I've, let, I've made at least three people buy games. <laughs> um... Honestly, my family knows so little about most things. Um, I could probably just wangle it and they wouldn't know. Things are shaping up nicely here, aren't they? Winter shouldn't be too bad this year. I just have a good time and I dance. And Reese is actually grateful. Graceful, not grateful. I mean, she might be grateful, I don't know. But that's not what he said. I mean, they know so little about things like this. I mean... My fa... <laughs> I... I... I had the same upbringing, but a lot of mine was online because my brothers were too busy with like being cool, and I didn't, I couldn't be cool because I'm just, I'm not. <laughs> so uh, they got to, they got to experience life the way most people do, which is going out and experiencing life. Where I stayed inside on the computer with my sister, which is the reason why we have a closer relationship. But one of the many reasons that we have a closer relationship. Um. So I would imagine telling them what it is I'm doing if it gets big. I think if I just told them I do content creation, they'd probably be all right. Mainly because they'd probably go, oh, okay, and then not ask any more questions. Or if they did, I'll just have to say to them what I do. Because if it works out, it could work out really well. It, I, mean, I don't expect it will, but it could do. And if it does, um, they're just going to have to get over it, aren't they? Because you're not a tick, yeah. <laughs> it would confuse them. What would confuse them more is if I have to show them uh, what it is that I'm doing and watch as their like, brain has to comprehend what this is. Because if they, they're probably aware of what a streamer is. Highly unlikely they are probably aware of what a VTuber is. Um... So if I just said I, I stream games, they probably wouldn't be surprised by that because they both know, both of them know that I game quite a lot. So they probably wouldn't be surprised by that. I don't think one would understand, the other one would, but you probably wouldn't see it as a proper job. Oh yeah. Would, you know, which is fine. They don't have to see it as a proper job. I don't see what they do as proper parenting with you. No, that was mean. Sorry. <laughs> but no, it, it will be fine. I don't think it's ever going to get to that point. And if it does, sorry. If it does, it does. It would be nice. I must admit, doing something you love and getting paid for it. The reason why I looked after children for so long. 
until I got old and tired and children became slight worse. Children haven't changed. Expectations for children have changed. Children are still the same. We just expect too much of them at a very early age. And parents have got... Parents used to be a lot more understanding about the fact that their child didn't do something immediately because all children are different. A lot of parents seem to have forgotten that or have become very... My baby doesn't do this because they. I read a book online and it told me my baby should do this in like six months. Every child is different. That's not the point. You need to make it so my child does this. It's very hard to get people out of that mindset because they're, it's their child and they want what's best for their child, but it's quite hard. And the amount of... I went in to look after children because I like looking after children and they're interesting and they're funny and they say really stupid shit. And I still tell tales now of the children I looked after and all the weird shit they said. Um, I understood there was paperwork behind it. I just didn't expect I'd have to be sat, sit there writing reports uh, in my summer holidays to work in a preschool. I just wanted to look after children. Uh, and unfortunately that wasn't what happened. But I understand it's to keep children safe, it's to help with their lively, you know, it's to help them future and teachers. But I can assure you right now, every achievement record I did for a child in preschool went straight up with them to uh, reception and the reception teachers just threw them away. So it seems like pointless. It seems like a pointless endeavor for me to waste like weeks of my summer holidays doing all this stuff. And my sister used to sit there and watch me do it. So she knew that I was doing it. Uh, for me to then send that on with the child to their next caregiver and then just throw it in the bin. <laughs> yeah, that's the problem is there's so much online nowadays and people think they could do a better job than you. Do you know what? If you could do a better job than me, I hope you do. Because I am not perfect. I, I wish I wish for people to be better than me. Unfortunately, if you get all of your info from stuff you find online, yes, I know, Mr. Ostrich, I'm sorry, uh, but you only read the half-truths and you don't fulfill everything, then you're not. But if you think that... Uh, sorry, it's, it's crazy the amount of paperwork compared to how much childcare workers get paid. If you consider that I got paid less than minimum wage... I got paid less than minimum wage. I could have worked in McDonald's and made more money. And they don't have to do paperwork unless someone gets shivved in the corner. I mean, they probably do now because they have to write all sorts. But, yeah. Sorry, I was reading chat. Don't get me wrong, there are certain TikTokers that have helped me be a bit parent or understanding and less shouty, but that's not the norm. The majority of social media parenting is just bullshit. Most of the social media parenting I see is the mums who have just had too much and they just drink too much wine. I know that they're the ones that do the jokey ones, but I follow quite a few men actually that do it and it's all it's it's about the skits and stuff like that but being a parent's hard and anyone tells you it isn't it's hard to lie i can't say i've paid attention to social media parenting advice no that's because you have me and if i don't know what it is we're like oh. <laughs> you've just tried to be the parent i needed as a kid yeah exactly and i think i think the age that we are we were brought up in the 80s not so much with my sister she was in the 90s but we were brought up in a time where it was a free-for-all it, it, everyone was everywhere but we also learned a lot of the things that we didn't want to replicate okay my brothers went out one day and pooed in a bush or climbed a tree and shat out a tree i would be horrified if i thought my daughter did that <laughs> but these were things that we did in the 80s i mean we were my brothers were feral. But they used to come back and they had to behave in the house, but outside they were feral. This is going to bode well if they find my videos. Um, 
But there was also a lot of things like our parents, well, my parents are a slightly different age to your parents, but our parents' generations had had to live through a war. So our parents' parents had had to live through possibly two wars and it was hard and they didn't have a lot and they had different rules and they had to be a certain way because that's the way things were. And then our parents were born and they were sort of trying to break it but not quite. Oh. And then and then we came along and it got worse. <laughs> And we now, with more education and more access, should be able to be better for our children because we shouldn't be doing this anymore. And I hope that we can all be better. And if anyone needs help, like, all they have to do is ask. And that's the problem. I think we went through a long stage of not asking for help because it was frowned upon because you don't ask for help. The family deals with it all on their own. And this is the reason why there's so many broken families. Because unfortunately, you can't always just do it on your own. You do ask to, you to ask for help. It's not embarrassing to ask for help if you honestly need it. And we need to get out of that mindset. Our grandparents weren't good parents. Oh, no. No, 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 no. How many have I got? Five, six, seven. I need seven. We have some very deep conversations here if you think we should be talking about Roots of Parcher. <laughs> I'm looking forward to parenting in Roots of Parcher. <laughs> if anything, asking for help shows that you have the strength to break the stigma from the previous generations. Yeah, exactly. And they'll look down on you, but at the end of the day, if they didn't feel strong enough, that's on them. Everybody should be able to ask for help. And if you can't, because you're not ready yet, that's fine too. But if you don't ask for help simply because you are too stubborn, that's different. Sorry, I'm just going to blow my nose. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I had to uh, blow my nose. It's the only problem with being in my office. is uh, It's quite cold, but it's also very dusty. I have cleaned it, but unfortunately when we had to have something done over the, the winter holidays... Um, <laughs> They, they kicked up a lot of dust and I can't clean it off. It's stuck to everything. And it's uh, it's making me sneeze. It makes me sneeze. Right, anyway, back to back to Roots of Patcher. You can get married and have children in Roots of Patcher. Whether I will get to that, I really need to start like bigging up here. I, there's there's going to be people watching this being like, what? Oh my God, I've had babies. It's just they're not mine. Ivex and Muffin's baby has arrived. At least most of the house is now warm. To be fair, a lot of the house is much warmer. It's just... Where I am, I'm behind a thick door, so the heat from that radiator doesn't come out. Come out, that's the word. Oh, he's a li Is it a girl? Is it a girl? Because I need your milkies. Oh, well, that's an inappropriate thing. Be better when it's warm and you can open the windows. In a pickle. Get from Ada. Thank you, Ada. Era? It oh, is this... Oh, a creative pickle. She's gonna. This might be how I get um, jams. I need to go talk to Era. Era, Era. <gasps> I'm sorry, Bunners. I forgot you were there. Don't love. No, do love me. Don't hate me. Jesus. Christ. Don't love me. <laughs> oh, that was a wheeze. Right. The only time I can open the windows is when they've stopped building across the road. So I'm hoping it is soon. Because uh, they're currently building... They're changing a larger house opposite the ro opposite us on the corner uh, into flats. And the problem is, is they've kicked up such a lot of dust um, that to have the windows open then coats everything in a very fine dust. Well, hello, cuteness. You're our boy. Oh, no. Two, two, two. Oh, dear. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, he's better than you. I don't want to... Are you ready to milk? I can't remember. Proper watering can. Time to breed with mommy! 
<laughs> I was literally just thinking, I wonder if I could breed you with your mum. Is that a thing? Oh my god. Ritz of Patcher, what have you done to me? Oh, plant knowledge went up. Problem <laughs> is, it makes perfect sense because in the wild, it, it probably happens all the time. But there's part of me that's like, this doesn't seem like a good idea. But then, of course, if they created it so you couldn't do that, then it would really hinder the way you could do stuff. <laughs> but then on the same merit, you'd have people going, Rock up my animals breed with their parents. Because it's creepy and weird. <laughs> I think it's inappropriate that it's not more like real life. Dude, if you want to breed with your mum, that's, that's something you need to go through, but you need to not bring this into my forums. <laughs> Sorry. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh. Time to head downstairs. Oh, sorry. No, that was you telling me you're heading downstairs. No, that's not real. <laughs> I thought I was your way of like, well, I'm shutting off the stream and leaving. <laughs> I don't need to be doing any that anymore. <laughs> Bless you. I appreciate you coming back every day. <laughs> I'm going to have to do a sort out, I think, because it's really irking me. Right, let's do that. Let's do that. Check. Oh, no, I said I had things to do, but it's fine. I don't know why I'm going all the way down to the... I mean, it's not closer. It's not further away. Sell those. Oh, sell those. I guess, really, I should have turned that into uh, oil. Do, 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 do. Oh, I need to talk to Era. Okay. Right there. Where is she? Over there. It's Spindle Hall. Spindle Hall. Well. Hello. I haven't been feeling too creative in the kitchen lately. In cooking, you can combine two different flavours and get something that tastes completely new. I think we can do the same thing with the fermenter and the brewer. If we were able to combine those processes, I think we could find more ways to preserve food and make it taste at the same time. We just need some things to experiment with. I actually have to make her a fermenter, a brewer, and three alcohol. Okay. Uh... How do I make the fermenter and brewer? Obviously, I've only ever been made wood, hardwood, and plant fiber. Oh, that's that's that's. Dude, there's trees everywhere, love. You do that yourself. Hey, Grandpa, I haven't spoken to you for ages. Sorry. Zelk reminds me of when I was young, just with more hair. Um, how do I make alcohol again? Any fermented grain. Didn't specify beer, did it? Just alcohol. Any alcohol. Uh, let's... And a... And a beck. Nice. Right, let's make some juice. <clears throat> and then put oh I can have, have to put them in through one at a time don't I awkward and then I need to make her own fermenter and her own the other one right in you go fine I won't do those until I need to though I think I have enough wood 
I'm in the wrong chest. Uh, yeah, I might need some more hardwood actually. And some more of this. <clears throat> I haven't actually been in to check the new area yet, either. Because they built the training grounds and I never actually went and had a look. Oh, it looks cool. Actually, that's really nice. I, just, I, can't, I can't walk around that. I'm too... Uh, sp oh, excuse me. That's supposed to be like a shot put thing? Where they swing it around for it? on my energy. Where is my... I have to ride the other one, don't I? The burb. My long burb. I think I've been in the savannah for a little while, so it's probably going to be quite a lot of seeds. Mm. Sorry, I didn't mean to sniff into the uh, thing. Oh, a cutscene. Oh, it's Tok. Tuk. Hello. You can do it, little buddy. Oh, it's the one he hid. So make sure they didn't kill it. Sit. Like me. Oh. Close enough. Oh, hey. I was wondering if I'd see you out here. I'd like you to meet Beast. Officially, at least, you were there when I found him. Sorry, I was acting a little weird then. Silly, right? Grob is just so... Well, he's cool. Rob intimidates a lot of people. You're cool too. Thanks. I'd say I try to be, but I realise that's part of my problem. My husband is so caring. Is that talk cool beast? <laughs> that's not nice. Some people in my clan say I'm not that smart. So I figured if I can't be smart, I should be tough, you know? Tough people aren't seen snuggling baby boars. But then I thought about it. Like, who's going to stop me? So if I want to teach Beast to stand, or sit, oh my god, he's doing it. He's a genius, or lay down. I will. Eventually, we just need to practice. I know you can do it, little buddy. Oh. Does he come with the baby pig if I marry him? Does he come with the pig? I'm not sure I've got enough space. Doth one come with pig? To be fair, all of the uh, romanceable candidates are okay, except for Jarrod. I'm sure he's someone's type, he's just not mine. just realised all of the animals have different splash um, things in the water as well. When I was running with her, see, so Hershey obviously does, or he, so does like the one splash, but when I was riding through with the Ibex, I noticed it had more splashes because obviously it's got more feet that go into the water at the same time. I like that. I like that a lot. I do appreciate care for detail. You better. You better come with that cute baby pig. Sorry, not that cutscene. I realise they're not actually here today. I unlocked it anyway. 
Because normally you have to unlock it with them being in the area, I think. Certainly, I've noticed that before. Ah, the builders are exploding things opposite again. Right. Well, the black alpaca is nice. I like the stripy one too. I never did end up doing my tier list, mainly because I couldn't figure out how to use the website. It all bodes so well, doesn't it? When you heat water too much, it goes somewhere, but where? Oh, excuse me. Sorry, I was just pulling myself up in the chair. There we go. Daisy, I think as well um, on the on the uh, VTuber thing. I do think when if I do get more people watching and stuff, I do think I might upgrade my model and actually pay somebody to upgrade it. Because obviously I made this one and my husband rigged it. But I might be tempted to get somebody to actually make a proper model. I can uh, I can assure you now I would not be turning into a uh, an anime girl with frog things. I actually saw because I uh, I go on the uh, VTuber Reddit frequently, and there's a lot of people going I don't understand why there's not more people who are just animals and they're like girls with animal bits on them, and then in the same thread it's not in the same thread but in the post underneath it was. I wish people would be more like a girl with outfits because I'm fed up of seeing furries. I can assure you right now that I am a frog, not because I wish to bang one, but because I thought it was cute. <laughs> the difference between a furry and somebody who wants to be a VTuber is a VTuber is just somebody who doesn't want to show their face and has a pretend version of themselves. A furry is somebody who wants to bang an an uh, a anthropomorphized animal. We should race dolphins someday. It says a big difference there. Well, that's fine. I like my model too. <clears throat> Sorry. And that's not implying I don't like my model. I do like my model, but I'd like... I'd like it to have a bit more movement, I think. So I'd like... And also, I... I <laughs> I don't have legs uh, because I wasn't very good. So I have like little thighs that you can see. Okay. I zoom in on myself here. Yeah. I don't know what that did. Nope. I think I crashed. No, nope, I'm all right. Um, so move this onto this screen no it's not gonna work right so as you can see i don't actually have any legs uh because i cut myself off there uh can you still see that yeah so i cut myself off at the bottom because i was supposed to have legs and i was going to sculpt it on a little frog that i'd seen which was sat on a little lily pad with his like belly flopped over 
Um, but unfortunately that didn't work out particularly well because it turns out legs are really hard to do. So, um... Got to make sure I'm positioned again correctly. So, uh, somebody who could give me legs would be amazing. So that would be a... Would be ideal, really. Somebody could give me legs. It might be too small. Sorry, I have to... Pos oh, no, that's too small. Why would I fiddle? There we go. Hey, that's fine. We're still looking all right on this side. Fine. So I was just checking everything. We're still fixing. So that's fine. Right. So you were bigger. I was bigger. Am I still? I'm small again. Yeah. Oh, I was bigger than this. Okay. Just trying to position it so I don't block anything. Well, I do. I block a little bit. Let's have a look. I block a little bit. Unfortunately, I'm quite a difficult shape. My elbows sort of... There we go. Yeah, that's good. There we go. So you can still see that the A and the A and B button do something, not what they do. Um, so yeah, I'd, I'd quite like somebody to... Somebody who I, I, you know, isn't just some rando who comes onto my... <laughs> who comes into my thing going, I do VTuber stuff. Uh, like a proper person I've actually vetted and found properly and can actually prove that they do work. Um, I think that would be good. And then I would like it if the arms did different things, and I would like it if the... And I would like it if the... Like, I had legs. That'd be cool. Uh, but that's not a right now. That's a... This will do for now. Also, I'd quite like... Because the, the mouth is... Obviously, it does move in time with me saying stuff, because we've arranged that. I would like it to be a little bit more precise, but the issue with that is I'd have to have a smaller mouth because my mouth currently goes from each side of my face uh, and it makes it very difficult for me to form individual letters. So at the moment, I have my mouth just sort of goes from small to big. Uh, so the, uh, the ideal one would be to eventually have it. So it went... Um, when I speak, it actually looks like I'm forming particular letters. Which, obviously, at the moment, it doesn't. But that's, uh, that's a not now one. Also, it's finding somebody who's willing to do an animal model and not a, uh, a girl with frog hat. Which is not what I want at all. Right, I'm going to have to take a quick break because I uh, need to go to the toilet. I will be back in about two to three minutes. So get up, stretch, go get yourself a drink, and I shall be back in a minute. Right, be right back.
Okay, I'm back. Oh, I hope everyone got up and stretched. I did. You made that much today. Oh, excuse me. Uh, I think my tool. Did I ever share? Should I go down and get that tool? Does that make it? Gift from Milo. Sweet. My charming bracelet. There you go. My my hose done. Right, what did I have to do? Fermenter. That's right, I need to keep turning into alcohol. I need to make her a fermenter and a brewer. Sweet. You're back. Excuse me, pardon me. Doop. Right, I nearly... Blip, 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 blip. I really need to start working on people. Because I feel like I'm just a, I'm just playing the game and ignoring everyone. So I might actually need to start actually paying attention to them. I guess. Oh, hey, Bunners. Hello, my lovelies. I actually no, I actually wasn't moving that and it moved on its own. I've already had to replace my Joy-Cons once. It's been drift. See she needs milk in now. Um Right. Not what I meant to do. Muffin can't produce milk. No, I know muffin can't produce milk. I want to... Right, I need that. I've got en enough. Right, oopsie daisy. So many things going on. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I can have one more animal in here. Or I could get rid of a ball. Right. Oh, recently mated will be ready in two days. Eh. No, I can't breed them yet. Okay. Very well. Awkward. Why can't you have a baby so quickly? Why is it lazy? <laughs> Do -do. Oh goodness, I'm really looking forward to going out for lunch, dinner later. <laughs> so we have to take uh we have to take our small one to the town because as she gets older it's becoming very clear that she has a bottom that will not quit which unfortunately means that she can't wear children's trousers anymore because children's trousers are not made for little people with curvy bottoms they're made for little straight people all the way down uh, and it means that she keeps accidentally showing her bottom at school and she's getting very upset because some of the boys are not basically being boys I was going to about to say assholes, but you're not really supposed to see horrible things about other people's children. Um, give her a rest. So we need to uh, need to take her into our local town this afternoon. Sort that out. So hopefully we're going to be able to get her some big girl trousers that go all the way down, or all the way up, which is more the issue. Um, and then we've decided we're going to take her out for tea. Also, we need to go to uh, the very expensive chocolate shop and buy ourselves some new what's it called uh hot chocolate mix hot chocolate mix jesus Christ. so we have a lot we have one of the fancy hot chocolate makers uh and we really struggle to get our daughter to drink milk She's always been funny. About six months she stopped drinking milk and it was actually a pain in the bottom because unfortunately she has a 
issue with her hip, which requires her to drink a lot of milk. Uh, and she won't. So it's, a, it's been a bit of a, uh, like, pulling teeth. So her drinking almost a whole thing of chocolate milk is actually quite useful. Because she doesn't... I, I think she's aware it's milk, but she's not aware it's milk, which is fine, because then she drinks it and I don't care. Um, because she'll drink... Oh, this, this is very inconvenient. So she'll drink, like, milkshake. Unless it's made from milk, is what her she said. So she'll drink milkshake if it's made of ice cream. I don't know the reasoning. That's just what she said. We don't know what we're getting. She'd like to go to Pizza Hut because she likes Pizza Hut. But the issue I have with Pizza Hut is I could be incredibly ill. Um, if I, if they, uh... to be fair, we might go to Pizza Hut because I, I don't think it's all you can eat. I still think you have to order at certain things. Uh, but they don't get, they don't get. What is that feather meal? They don't get to have pizza very often with tomato sauce on it. Uh, so I, I'm happy for them to have that. And they do pasta at Pizza Hut. Because over that she was like, oh, that's all right, man. We'll just go to McDonald's. And the problem is, is I like McDonald's. McDonald's, the one near us at least, does not give you the option of not having tomato ketchup in it. So unfortunately, that doesn't help me either. If I were that, was she secretly trying to kill me off? I mean, there's lots of places in town, and we can go wave at her auntie, who's probably grumpily working anyway. Uh, right, what am I supposed to do? So, it said this was a puzzle. I don't know quite what it means. It says, patch a pair of rocks. So there's a... okay. Oh, I see a bear thing there. We we're all very excited for Yosushi. See, I'd like to go to Yosushi, but I don't think she'd eat the bento box. I, I mean, I'd be, I'd happily go to Yosushi, but I don't think they do a chicken katsu one. But it's the fact that the rice comes with vegetables in it. I don't think she'd be, I don't think she'd eat it. And it sounds awful. Yosushi's quite expensive for us to waste it if she's not going to eat it. But she won't eat anything else. That's that one done. Because there is a Yosushi near us, so we could use that. They do skewers. Yeah, but you assume that she'd eat that. <laughs> She's quite picky. I mean, picky enough that she will eat happily something one day and then the next day she will be like, I don't eat that anymore. Why? What's wrong with it? I just don't eat it. But nothing's changed. It's the exact same thing you ate yesterday. I just don't eat it now. It's like, why? Or we finally, like, buy something that we know she's enjoyed. Um... And then she'll only eat it for two days and then be like, can I have something else now? But you've already like bulk bought cheese spread. Like yesterday, yeah, don't eat sausages. But we specifically bought the sausages that she'd eaten. And then she was like, I don't really like sausages. And I'm like, but you've eaten them. Like, th these are the same sausages we've had for the last four sausage, you know, times we've had sausages. So yeah, but I don't really like them now. That's all right. I've got cold sausage sandwiches for my lunch. I'm all right. I mean, it's a bit irritating, but it's fine. Can't break gold yet. Oh, there's another painting. Ooh, some water. Can I fish it? If I ever invent a drink, it'll come in red or white. Okay, so it's wine. The other one's wine. Everybody, it's wine. We'll get that. Booze. Right, I'm going to see if I can fish here. What is this room called? It's not called a room. I mean, it is called a room. It's just not. It doesn't have a name. Oh, is that like really bloomed for anyone else? Like really bright? No, on the screen it looks all right. For me, that is quite bright. Yours doesn't like sausages either. 
You say this. And then he came to my house and he ate sausages. So this is the thing. I keep getting told all these children do and don't eat and then he eats it. You think the background's too dark? Oh, it could be, yeah. It was like I've been told the other small boy that comes to visit doesn't eat chips. And yet we had, last week, we weren't feeling very well, so we had a takeaway with the night we were looking after him. And he was like, chips. I'm like, we don't eat chips. Mummy's told me you don't eat chips. He said, chips. So we gave him chips and he, he like ate mine and his own. So in fact, he does eat chips. And now we'll eat chips all the time for her. But beforehand, wouldn't eat chips. Oh, funny little people. That's all he ate. Yeah, he ate two portions of the chips, refused the meat. We bought him some really nice chicken. He wouldn't eat it. He just he wanted to eat the chips. But he ate, which is fun. A fed child is a happy child. Which is all we live for in this house. Just eat something, please, dear Lord, eat. Although then he kept asking for cookies. And I was like, no, you haven't, you haven't eaten. So he begrudgedly ate one piece of bacon, giving me evils, like trying to dominate me <laughs> the whole time. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's Jasper. He then was like, cookies. So I gave him a bag of cookies. Oh, David, uh, sorry, Tar gave him a bag of cookies. And I, we, we accidentally bulk bought um, the Maryland cookies but my daughter likes the chocolate ones we didn't buy the chocolate ones we accidentally bulk bought like a caramel flavour like a crunchy caramel flavour and she really doesn't like them apparently neither does he because he was biting into it and you could see his face of like what on uh, this isn't a cookie I've been lied to we, we didn't lie it is a cookie it's just not the cookie he thought it was going to be uh, and he was just displeased so he basically, he ate his way through it and he ate two out of this bag and then he was just like, no, no cookies. And I'm like, but you wanted cookies. And he's like, no, no, no cookies. <laughs> I don't know if it's because he thought maybe they weren't really cookies and I'd lied to him. This is clearly a vegetable. You've lied to me. Nasty Auntie Plu. You lied. This is clearly a this is vegetables in some way. But yet we'll eat fruit flakes and knows they're called fruit flakes and we'll be happily fine. But I tried to feed him a pea and you'd think I'd try to kill him. Unless they're all tired. They could be all tired, to be fair. It's been hard. It's a it's a hard life when you're very small. Oh, hello. These vines need water. If only was a way to splash a bunch of it on them. Stuff is all around. Look at me being so clever. Door down there. The door there. There's only two doors in this room, so it's there. Okay. The thing is, the rocks are getting harder to break. I haven't gained any other ore yet, but then I guess I only really just got the copper ore, didn't I? Can I go in there? No, that can't be a way to go. I mean, the little boy was very tired yesterday. He actually cuddled up on me and fell asleep and was like drooling all over me. <laughs> He's lucky, I love him. I don't let anybody just dribble all over me in their sleep. Then he sort of wake up about an hour before his mum was going to turn up. Problem is, is we, we look after him till quite late at night because his mummy has to work and unfortunately the only job she could get was one that doesn't finish till like nine o'clock at night. So he's very small, but he uh, has to stay up. 
But the problem is, is him staying up means that our daughter gets grumpy because she wants to stay up because he gets to stay up. So she tries to keep herself as wake, uh, for awake as long as she can. And then the next day when we have to get her ready for school, she's really grumpy. And it's like, why would you do this to yourself? Just go to sleep. Well, he was awake. Yeah, but he's allowed to be... Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. I don't think I realised that was a way there. Okay. Well, that doesn't mean I can teleport back there. That's fine. Is that what that meant? Yeah. <clears throat> bear room. Oh, I found the room. Bear is the best. Unless she's hungry. Or woken up. Or you forget her birthday. Oh, I found the bear totem. Cool. Whoops. Okay. Wow, her totem's massive. If you compare... Oh, thank God there's a teleport point. If you compare all of the other totems, like the monkey one and the, the owl one, about how big this one is. And the horse one's quite small, actually, as well, isn't it? Do you remember when I said I really need to start making friends with the townspeople and then I just completely went off and did something else and didn't actually speak to any of them? Yeah, that's, that's the thing I did. This is fine. I'm sure it's fine. I'm going to have to make some more wine, aren't I? I need one for... I need one for the... There as well. Oh, I can't... Fine, I will go to sleep if you're going to do like this. I'm asleep. Pa happy now. Oh, they're now going to start working on the river overlook. I did not so much today. I think I was supposed to go pick up some tools. And I may have forgotten. This is fine. Right. Put that in there. That's fine. Oh, no, no, don't do that. <clears throat> right, we've got that one. That one. A gift from Reese. Sculpting, but with... Oh, you are. Garrick wants a comfy place to sit by the river and study it. Where is that? Yeah, that's exactly where I assumed they'd put it. Uh, because him and Ibon like to sit there. Go up and go. Sort these ones out. Hello, darlings. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. No. Yeah, if we could convince the small one to go to Yo Sushi today, I'd be quite happy with that. I just I don't think she's going to be convinced, because she'd like pizza. And they don't do anything that's like a pizza.
other sushi establishments are available, just not near me. Well, that's, a, that's a lie. We have several, but it's just they don't do anything that she'd eat. Where we know that at least that place, she there might be something she might eat, possibly. You can download the menu. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. To be fair, I think there are some things that she would eat. Can I put the cheese in the fermenter? No, milk. <clears throat> Sorry, I <nearly> choked. <laughs> I think she'll probably be fine. She might get grumpy, but she'll probably eat it. I mean, she likes chicken, so. She'll be alright. Right. I think it'll be fine. Right, let's put these two in here. Make some coconut cheese. I'm sure that's fine. Mmm, coconut cheese. Hey, crop. Oh, he loves his wife, that's sweet. I should hope so. Where is his wife? She's down there. Oh, yeah, I actually should have read that out. Reese has been so excited about creating with the others. They sell a normal katsu and rice. Oh, really? Oh, she might eat that then, because it's just like a giant chicken nugget, isn't it? As long as it doesn't come with the curry sauce, because she will not eat the curry sauce. Here's your new tool. I made it. It's going to last for years. Thank you. I finally have my hoe. I just should go jump in some leaves. That kid works too much. Oh, I have. Oh, no, I can upgrade it to a copper hoe. I think I have that much. That's just typical. <laughs> the only other tool you could upgrade was the copper hoe, and I just didn't bother upgrading it. Right, let's go upgrade me copper hoe. Normal wood, isn't it? And copper. I have quite a lot of copper. Just typical. I'm sure you can request it too to not source it. Oh, yeah, I might do that. And just, well, to be fair, we have had pizza this week. If she could have a choice of pizza, she'd have pizza. Oh, oh no, I didn't do it. It's fine, I'm sure this is fine. Oh, well. Now I know what she likes. We're going to get the bento and request that the sauce not be on it. Yeah, she won't eat it with the sauce. But I will happily sit there and pull stuff off. Also, I know she likes the Doriakis, the little uh, pancakes with the sauce in the middle. She really, really likes those. So I might be able to convince her into the fact that she can have the little pancakes with the sauce in the middle. Because we used to just buy those outright. But the place that we used to go to just, uh, doesn't exist anymore. Uh, right. Where is he? There again. He's there. Can't do that just yet. I probably need to chop some more wood, actually, thinking about it. I've just used some. I'm sure it'll be fine. She might like that. It might be because it's different for her. 
The leaves here are so vibrant. You look great today. But everyone's been telling you that, huh? No, just you, really. What a nice boy. What a nice boy! The overlook is going to be great. It just needs a few adjustments. This doesn't seem dangerous. This was already a nice place to watch the river. That'll be an extra nice place to watch it. It's nice seeing Garrick this excited about a project. It it does seem a bit dangerous. I hope they put a fence around it. Hey, Ivan. My dad made my mum potato salad. It's so romantic. Okay. Gerard thinks Ilo has a crush on him, but that's dumb. If someone has a crush on me, I'd know. No, I thought Gerard had a crush on Isla, but she doesn't have a crush on him. Mainly because I think she likes Freya. I really need to... Uh... Right, let's go find some stuff. I really need to figure out what the men like. That's the problem. Because a lot of the women like me, but I don't really know what a lot of the men like. Except for the one that likes poo. And I kind of just... I, I refuse to give... I refuse to give resources... I refuse to give poo to anyone. Don't worry about falling this season. You can spring back up later. Dad jokes, no! Oh, 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 oh. Aren't I hysterical? No! You should be ashamed. I don't think that my dad ever taught da uh, said dad jokes. Just used to get on with it. Hello. My dad loves those yellow squashes that go around. Do I know what you like? Sounds awful. I don't think I've ever spoken to you. He hates the coconuts, that's right. Garrick likes seaweed, so he's easy. Oh, is he? Not him. Yeah. Crack is currently busy. Well, <laughs> sorry. Oh, my mind went really dirty then. His crack is currently busy. Fine, keep going. Which is we've run this way. Garrick likes seaweed because I quite like Garrick. He's a thinker. I quite like smart boys. I have lots of seaweed. I just need to not accidentally give him the weed. No, well, apparently everybody likes mangoes. I think everybody loves mangoes, and then there's like four or five people who like it, but they don't love it. But the problem is, is I only... For some reason, my I don't think my mangoes have grown. What's Garrick? This bodes well, doesn't it? You can give him seaweed. That's really easy. Which one is he again? I know their names. I think it's that one. I like Jag as well. I think he's cool. Do you like this seaweed? Fascinating, thank you. Sweet. Well, would you like to dance with me, Jag? Why are you so busy? Stop being busy. Is that a dog? Yes. Are you Biscuit? You're Scara. One of them apparently likes me. And I think it's the one that I occasionally speak to. I've spoken to you. It's best to go with the flow, even during the rocky bits. Well, you've got my stuff. Here's the charming amulet, where it often to unlock all of its power. Actually, I might put that on if I'm going to start trying to get people to like me. Waves get start to get extra fun this time of the year. The swells can be pretty big. I love cooking tamales with Jizu, they're her favourite. That's nice. I'm quite hungry. Oka and Jellerod are great musicians, but Ibon plays like she's carving the air. Is that a nice thing to say? Just like she's carving air. Right. That's fully bonded. Oh, it also gives me an ore yield. I did think I was getting a lot of stuff. Ooh. Ooh, I like that. So you can now choose which to marry. Yeah, I did. Gerald likes hardwood, which again is an easy one. Oh. Harvest yield. I quite like that. I do want the stamina. Right, I can swap. Oh no, I can't swap out every day, can I? Let's use the top one as one I can swap out. 
So the charm it gives me five charm, doesn't it? it? Makes me it makes their flowers go up quicker, I'm assuming. And then I have the one that makes presents better. Do you know what? I really need to start using some of these. That's fine. Because they don't once they're bonded, you can use them whenever. Yielding more honey. Use this one. Because then I'm doing the gift giving and a charm. Right, he likes hardwood, does he? Can I give... I guess that makes sense because he like, his thing's the fire, isn't it? Oh my god, I nearly killed Grandpa. Grandpa, I'm sorry. Festivals are a good time to catch up with everyone and I'm slightly concussed. I'm sorry, Grandpa. I'm sorry. Gelrod. No, not Gelrod. What's his name? Jag. No, we don't, we're not doing anything with Gelrod. Sometimes the simplest things are the best. Thank you. Like me. Oh, feels bad. Right, did that actually gain them anything? I do have a cutscene with somebody, I'm pretty sure. Or I might have already had it. Do it like the girls. Ibon loves me. Ilo. Oh no, Jag's now the same as Ilo. How the hell are you raising up? I'm not even speaking to you if I can help it. I like Jesus, she's cool. I guess he might like thread. He was neutral to wild tomato juice. Yeah, I guess he probably likes, like, um, clothing stuff. I don't think I've ever, I've ever given her a gift. But Voda. She was neutral to a wild date. She didn't like our wild date. That was terrible, I'm sorry. Hey, Arta. You're adorable. You're my favourite. Jared thinks Ilo is a crush on him, that's dumb. I agree. That's because your brother's dumb. Sorry. He can't help it. Except he can. He just chooses not to. I really like the way that Hal moves. Although, perspective-wise, this just looks really weird. Looks like you'd sort of sit at the bottom. Oh, they're done. Cool, let's make some more coconut cheese. Coconut, coconut, coconut cheese. Nope. Let's crush the coconut. I wonder how much... Uh... Nope. Don't put the shell in. Don't put the shell in. There we go. So. Coconut milk. Sells for 30. Coconut cheese sells for 90, which is good. It's not as good as the Ibex milk, but I think, you know, that's the best one. So I right. don't want that in there. That, that. I'm going to keep those on me and keep giving them to my bay. Oh, I didn't like that at all. There are some words that I think get to the point where you shouldn't say them after a certain age. Turns out bay is probably one of them. Right. Um, I don't think it's hardwood. I need to make a fermenter. You have to be right in the way. Hardwood and plant fibre. Sure, we'll do it like that. That's all I need to run around holding the fish. Right. Where is she? Don't get stuck on... She's in the thing. She's going to be asleep. 
I mean, it's eight o'clock. Can't imagine she'd be asleep, but I will be staring at her as she is. Please do not be asleep because it's early. Hi, Ivan. Oh, no, I already knew that. My mum never wants to seem weak, but she has to be missing our old home. But you? You. These are perfect. I'll talk to Ron and Nock, then we can combine ideas as well as flavours. Vinegar pickling. Let me know if you want to try something new. No, I'm trying to dance with you. He's busy. Right, Sodger then. Do you want to dance with me, Voda? No, fine, jog on. Nobody loves me. The trees have got very nice things to say about you recently. He said something about tradition and then blah. He's thinking about grandma. Stop thinking about my grandma. Please stop thinking about my grandma. No, she deserves to be happy. That's fine. But I deserve to not have to know about it, which is best. Right. So. Inspect. Oops. I need to get some more wood. What? The animal's being so messy. <clears throat> right. So. I think that's probably a good point to leave it. Have a look. They're going to finish the river overflow. Right. So. Thank you very much for coming to visit today. I shall be back on Monday. Um, we're playing Roots of Patch Up and nothing's going to change. But I need to go have food and then I need to go pick up my small child uh, and go get her some trousers that fit. So, I thank you all for coming to visit today. I hope you all have a lovely day and a good weekend. And I shall see you all next week on Monday at 10 o'clock. I can remember words. GMT. At 10 o'clock GMT. Uh, thank you very much. So I shall see you all. I'll see you all Monday. Thank you. Have a lovely weekend. Bye bye.